Ladies and gentlemen, we have tag team action coming up. And given the state of the tag team division right now and how incredibly competitive it is, this match might just make or break one of these teams. As we get ready for this tag team match, Byron, tell me, who do you like in this one? Come on, Michael, you know I can't answer that. Look at these teams. They both have what it takes to be the most dominant team WWE has seen in quite some time. There's almost no way to confidently pick one over the other. The captain of Team Kick. Traveled the world over when it comes to legitimate tough women. Dakota Kai is at the top of the list. The first female competitor from New Zealand to make her name at this level. Time tag team match underway here. Jarring impact. Oh, and it's trapped now and just a bang! Oh man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Looking to lock it in here. She better do something fast. She somehow breaks free. But you have to wonder how much damage was done. Dominating shoulder tackle. Uh-oh. This isn't going to be pretty. Suplex. Tag, and here comes his partner. And this is not going to be good for their opponent. Oh. oh, that was a long way down. Boom! <laughs> There have been times in sports entertainment when unlikely duos have formed and over time they develop and bond and become an outstanding tag team combination. The team that immediately comes to mind is the powerhouse duo of Cesaro and Sheamus. After their thrilling best of seven series, I wouldn't think they'd develop into a top tag team. Oh, continuing to punish them. She's starting to stagger a bit. Her and her partner aren't going to let this derail them, though. I don't think anyone thought Cesaro and Sheamus would develop into a premier tag team. Over time, the superstars realized that they were better as allies than as enemies. And when they combined their incredible strength, 
the results were something that couldn't be ignored. It was really unbelievable to witness the evolution of Cesaro and Sheamus as a team. We saw them improve every week and conquer a variety of opponents. To see the Swiss Cyborg and Celtic Warrior go from unwilling partners to WWE Raw Tag Team Champions was truly impressive. In a tag team contest, a superstar and partner lock up against another duo. Unless there's a special stipulation added to the match, the traditional rules of a singles match apply in terms of winning the match via pinball, submission, countout, or disqualification. Oh man, Dakota Kai just barely got out of the way. Irish whip in a standard. She hits it, Dakota Kai brings everyone to their feet. But is it enough to end it? Jeez, I don't like Ember Moon's chances in this one. Oh, nasty impact. So impressive. The night could be over for Ember Moon. Dakota Kai into the cover. And she kicks out. Wow. We're looking at complete domination here. For many years, members of the WWE Universe and the WWE Locker Room have felt that tag team matches should have two referees. One referee is in the ring over... There it is. She's made the tag. And her partner is on absolute fire right now. Papa Shango struggling a bit. Heard her partner making a great tag team. We'll see what they're made of here. I really like the resolve we've seen from her in this tag team match, guys. Though, I wouldn't be against the tag here. You know, just so she can gather herself a bit. Byron, earlier you raised a point that people have been talking about for years, and that's a second referee being appointed to tag team matches. I remember WWE Hall of Famer and former WWE President Gorilla Monsoon used to express his strong advocacy for two referees being appointed to tag team matches. Uh, it's something that's been talked about for decades, Michael, and I don't think it's ever going to happen. We've seen it on occasion, but I think it's best to let the superstars be responsible for themselves. And the appointed official for the match needs to do the job they're paid to do. I don't think it's that much to ask. Kai is the first ever New Zealand woman to reach this level for Shima. And Zagiri finds its mark. She got her good there. You can see the confidence just beaming from her right now. Dakota Kai's offense, we mentioned how the Kiwi is an elusive target. But we also have to detail her striking more, Byron. You would think Dakota's kicks would get weaker as the match goes on, but really, they only get stronger. Here goes Papa Shango. She's looking at it. A few inches off there. Inches? She missed by at least a foot, Cole. And the slam! Up goes Papa Shango. Papa Shango, this is going to be big. What could Papa Shango do here to up the odds for success? You can see her partner wants to get tagged in here. She's taking on quite a bit of damage here, guys. And if she doesn't find a way to make the tag soon, this one might be over. Oh, man, this match is so evenly matched. It's unbelievable. Any one of these women can win at this point. She has to be careful here, guys. One well move, and she's going to find herself taking the loss here tonight. She's calling for it. She's got it now. When you talk about great tag teams, we can go all the way. He hits it. Dakota Kai brings everyone to their feet. This one is over. We may be looking at our winner here, guys. Jeez, I don't like Ember Moon. She hits it. Dakota Kai brings everyone to their feet. Now, she just needs to finish. We've got to cover. One, two. Beautiful technique. Hooked up. Oh, shit breaker. I knew it was only a matter of time. Wow, Q 
kicking butt and taking names. Look at her go. Up and down, leg lariat. Oh, and she gets out of the way. Oh, man, Dakota Kai just barely got out of the way. Handstand. Oh, man, Dakota Kai just barely got out of the way. That has got to be it. She hits it. Dakota Kai brings everyone to their feet. Wow, she's fought her way. She goes for the cover. One, two, three. And we have our winners.